This is the big boy. So this is called the big boy and it says blower pro right there. So they have a mini version of this, which is pretty good as well. And they have the pro, which I got. So I got the big boy pro. So what this does is blow off any type of water anywhere on the car. So, you know, when your side mirrors has water trapped in them, this will get it out. When you need to dry your wheels and knock all the water out, this will get it out. When you need to get the water out of your calipers, this will get it out. This is something that everyone needs to have and it will save you so much time drying your car show you the box and get a close-up of it so it says touchless car motorcycles marine dryer so if you have a car motorcycle marine this is what you need filters heated air so it filters heated air so you can dry up that air as well prevents water spotting eliminates scratches and streaking does not remove wax that is sick and prevents rust that is dope always 20 celsius or higher than the surrounding environment the most efficient twin motor system in the industry easy change foam filter use warm fil filtered air low noise reduction technology adjust wind control wind speeds from 72 kilometer uh, kilometers up to 28 288 kilometers so that is pretty dope that's how it looks on the side and this is how it looks it's like a dual motor on each side so lower noise reduction technology with twin filter system the more efficient twin motor system in the industry so guys this is the top of the line one that they make and it has wheels and everything you do not have to get this one you can get the mini but i decided to get this one so i can give you guys a better review and um i know a couple detail shops the guy who detailed my type r he has a big boy as well he wants me to um let him know how the pro is i think he has a mini and then another shop that gonna be tending my car he also has a mini as well so i had to get one of these when i seen it um at their shop so can be safely used on different surfaces such as metal plastic glass to blow away water and dust and dust for the vents oh man this is this is the ultimate package right here this is the ultimate package and also guys the hose is rubber so that is pretty dope so gonna go ahead and open this thing up and the guys it's also made from australia so someone in australia made this so this is pretty dope So, got the instruction manual with the filters, filters, instruction manual. You got the rubber hose on top. So, the hose looks like this. Yeah, it is really rubber. Really nice. It smells good too. It's the rubber hose. I'm gonna try to place this somewhere else. Got the power cord. Just gonna flip this upside down. Definitely looks top notch. So the wheels are already on there. Got this. Other phone. Two phones on it. Pretty dope. So this is how the big boy comes already set up. So you got your power cord, it's pretty long, that is sick. And you have half speed, full speed, and then you have your other motor over here for half speed, full speed, so that is sick. So this one has two wheels on there. I believe the mini only has one wheel, but seems pretty legit. Very easy to set up, plug and play. All right, so just stick stick this in here and twist it and then it locks in place i think you can twist it the opposite way so you don't see a screw at all so yep. 
So, looks like that. Guys, I almost missed this. Do not miss this because it's on the that holds the size of the blower. There is the attachments to it. So I got this one right here. It looks like this. Pretty nice. And then they got another attachment that looks like this. I'm gonna put this one on. It slides on like this. And then it's just turn it to the side so it can place. Yep, so it looks like this. So I'm gonna go ahead and test it out real quick. You guys probably seen me making a bunch of videos of my new 2019 Honda Civic Type R in Rally Red. This car is beautiful, amazing, turbo, immaculate, front wheel drive, amazing. And then if you're an old subscriber, you also know about my 2011 Honda Civic Si. This is a 2011. This was the last generation they made of this car in 2011. I have done a lot of the stuff to this car. If you guys go back to a lot of my old videos, I have done a lot of stuff. As you can see, I did the front lip, side skirts, rear lip, wing, visors, carbon fiber hood, the JDM emblems. This car is also on air suspension. I've done a lot of stuff to this car. Amazing. And I still have some more stuff that I want to do to this car. But stay tuned for the upcoming video because I'm going to be talking about that very soon. And I'm going to show you guys how everything looks. This is big boy. This is the attachment. Actually, when you turn it on and it blows the air out, this hose actually expands, which is pretty dope. The whole hose and everything is basically rubber. Even the end of it is rubber as well. When it gets dark, these light up and indicate and let you know that it's running and it's on. These are the different type of speed. Each side, it is dual motor. Each side has the same thing. So it has the full speed and then a the half speed and then they have the off in the middle. Full speed is, is pretty strong already and half speed is pretty light to like blow stuff out and stuff like that. The best settings for this, for the uh, Big Boy Blower Pro, I would say it's the full speed and then the half speed. Having both of those combined, it will knock all of the water off of the car. The roof, the wheels, the side mirrors, and that's, the, I would say, the greatest part of having this blower. This is a must-have. All right, so I have the big boy plugged in with an extension cord. Um, she's a little bit wet. So what I'm going to do is turn it on to the half speed so I can show you guys. So half speed, you want to try to grab it quick. So the half speed... It's really like, it ain't much, right? As you can see, the water is moving, but it isn't much. The full speed will definitely get the job done. As you guys can see, it is blowing the water off. Right? So the full, just one, the one motor one will definitely work and get the water off. But I say the full speed as you can see, I'm getting the water off of this now. It does the job. But with the dome motor, I would say definitely you want to have the full speed on. Or you want to have the half speed. So now, as you guys can see, it's expanding more. Right? So now that I do the roof, it's going to look like this. It's just going to beat off. See? It's just beating off. off the window. See? Like it now. Kind of hard to see, but the water is definitely uh, beating off right now. That's crazy. So I came out here at 
6.41, I started uh, basically washing the car and the car is dry. An hour later, the car is dry, completely dry. And let me show you, might be a little bit of water spots here and there, but it is pretty much dry. Got some water spots up there that I can touch up or blow off with a rag. All up here is dry. The wheel, the wheel is completely dry. The back of the window is completely dry. Spoilers dry. A bit of water right here, just sitting right there. But um, got a little bit of water right here. I see. The whole wheel is dry. This side is dry. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So I just gotta go over basically a little bit and touch up some spots of little water droplets just sitting there and crazy that is crazy how long that took me wow like 45 minutes maybe uh 30 minutes that's amazing saves me a lot of time and this car has a lot of nicks and crannies and stuff like that the doors i did not do the doors yet but I'm gonna knock them out real quick. The exterior takes a lot of time. All the nooks and crannies to hatch, everything, it takes a lot of time. So, man, that's amazing. This blower is a must have. I'm gonna post a link in the description so you guys can pick up a big boy blower for sure. So one thing I would highly recommend is if you do get the big boy blower pro, I highly recommend you guys that your car at least have some type of good wax on there that will bead off as soon as you put water on there to wash it off or your car is ceramic coated if your car does not have some type of wax or ceramic coating on it it will definitely a lot harder for any of that water to come off it will basically of course leave some type of water spot on the car so you definitely want to get a good wax or ceramic coating on the car and this definitely make your job a lot easier drying the wheels the tires underneath the footwell the side mirrors side skirts wing all of the little uh nooks and crannies for the window trim everything will be dried in less than 35 to 45 minutes which is amazing the whole car is dry you don't have to touch the wheels you don't have to touch the body of the car you might have to go back go back over and touch uh little bit of spots here or a little bit of uh dry water marks here and there but boom, you're done. This car is definitely a must have in getting ceramic coated. This car has a lot of nooks and crannies and crevices all over. And of course, when you open up that hash, water just sits there. So this is a must have. This is a must have if you have a Civic Type R. And I highly recommend you guys Civic Type R ceramic coated. And I highly recommend you guys get the front end of the Civic Type R PPF as well. If you guys don't know what PPF is, it's paint protection film. It's a clear film you put over like the front end of the car from uh, rock chips, bugs, etc., etc., that will impact your car while you're driving. But that's it, guys. I hope this video was very helpful. I want to thank all of you guys that have been subscribing to the channel. I saw that we hit a little bit over 7k subscribers and the subscription keeps going up so thank you guys for showing so much love and support and a lot of you guys have been commenting in the videos that a lot of you guys have been watching my videos and a lot of you guys have recently picked up a 2020 type r so that is amazing that you guys are looking at stuff that you guys plan to do to your type r or you guys are using my videos for inspiration to pick you up a type r so that is pretty dope as well i will be dropping more videos everything has been crazy for the last i would say two months with everything finally opening back up and things have been getting busy but the videos are coming back i have a lot of things to share with you guys that you guys are probably going to be excited for for the civic type r and the agent honda civic si so i cannot wait to share with you guys that's it for the video guys if there is anything that you guys want to achieve find your inner drive that thing that drives you to take a step toward your goals every single day and make it happen peace